I'm using center fixed focus area and the overlay graphics won't show the crosshairs for some reason. So I made my own. You're supposed to see it in the EVF or on the LCD screen. So here it is. I set focus area by custom key to tracking on using the side button of the lens to toggle between subjects. I'll show you how in this video. When I untoggle by pressing the side button, the crosshairs appears until I toggle to have it focus and stay put and to track it temporarily. I'll show you the documentation from Sony in a bit. This really sticky tracking that you see here cannot be done without using custom key or dial set in advance, which I will show you how. Again, I untoggle to switch to another subject and when the subject is centered, then I toggle it. There, it will stick. It's an impressive feature for sure. There are a lot more settings for each recognition target like tracking shift range, tracking persistent level, recognition sensitivity, parts and priority set, hopefully for another video. The audio that you're hearing is preset right out of the camera. I just want to test the audio at the same time and see how it sounds. The autofocus is so sticky, I am impressed again. Here's the side button I assigned using custom key set in advance. You may ask why couldn't you set it to recognize animals and birds as subjects and have pressed the shutter button or use the back AF button to do this. I tried, I couldn't. It would focus but wouldn't stick. Take a look. I tried half pressing the shutter, press and press and hold the back AF on button, you'll get that green box for an eye or green crosshairs but neither would stick. It's like you have to recompose, refocus all the time. And there is nothing wrong with that, just more convenient the other way. So let's take a look at how I set this thing up. Make sure you're in movie recording mode. Press menu and scroll down or hit the setup tab. Select it. Go to and select operation customize group and select movie custom key slash dial set item. Then the button of your choice. I choose the focus hold button on the lens. You could see that it's selected. Next, go and hit the AFMF tab and choose focus area. There you'll see tracking on and tracking on toggle. If you choose tracking on, you'll have to press the button and hold to focus. If you choose tracking on toggle, you'll just have to press to toggle to focus and not have to hold the button until you untoggle. And that's it, you're ready. You might have noticed that you could also do all of this for shooting still images, not just video. But for that, I just use the back AF on button or have pressed the shutter button. Sh shutter, shutter. And here's more tests I just pointed to the TV. This time without the crosshair graphics. And set recognition target to human. Sorry about the quality, it just upscaled to 4K. As you can see, I make sure the subject is centered before I toggle to focus. Here is just jump to another person. If you made it this far, let's take a look at the documentation from, from Sony Help Guide. As you can see, this is for Alpha 7R Mark V. You could pause at any time. Here's where I learned to do this. Changing the setting for focus area to tracking temporarily, tracking on by custom key. Don't forget you can pause and examine it. One thing I want to say about this AI autofocus, I wish I don't always have to set 
recognition target to one specific subject. I hope for a firmware update that can bring auto priority recognition target to who or whatever is at the center. As you can see, it does not recognize human subjects from animal or bird subjects. Anyway, thank you for watching. Do come back.